This video will demonstrate how to operate NetClay with a gyro. Here is the gyro sensor. It is worn on the side of your head and senses which direction your head moves, whether it's up, down, left, or right. You can attach it to a headband, hat, or even clip it onto your glasses. To begin using the gyro, connect it to the NetClay Hub port zero. The gyro can be programmed to do many functions. Here, we will show you how to do basic mouse cursor movements, as well as left and right clicks. A tip for moving the cursor is to compare it to kicking a ball. You have to swing your leg back to collect momentum before kicking the ball forward. Just like that, to move the cursor to the left, you have to move your head a little to the right first, and turn your head to the left. You will hear a beep, and the cursor on the screen will move to the left. Move your head back to the center to stop the cursor. To move the cursor to the right, turn your head to the right. You will hear a beep, and the cursor on the screen will move to the right. To stop the cursor, move your head back to the center. The same technique can be used for moving the cursor up or down. Now, let's move on to right and left clicks. To do a left click, move your head quickly to the left once. To do a right click, move your head quickly to the right once. The gyro can be used in combination with other peripherals. For example, you can use the gyro to move the cursor left, right, up and down, and use button, joystick, or touch sensors to do right and left clicks. The gyro is challenging to learn, so please be patient and dedicate some time to practice using it. Once you become more proficient, you will be able to move the cursor with smaller head movements. It definitely gets easier with practice.